Hello, hello, and welcome to Losers Become Winners for September 21st with Alpha's leading with CVX at 58%. There it is, 58%. And look, we were anticipating the price to keep going up. Look, I drew the line last week, and what happened? Now it's gone in the other direction. So we'll bring back, we'll leave it here. We'll leave our, uh, our trend line here, and we'll bring the line back to that point. And then we're going to wait. We're going to wait a couple of days and see if we get if we get any more down action to draw another there another trend line to figure out an anticipation of where this exit might occur. But as long as we keep getting the separation between the exp, uh, the entry price and the 30 day moving average, the better it is. So uh, that or we get 42%. We gain 42% here on CVX, then we'll be going to last bar high for the exit. Remember, we're looking at a 1167 on the ode, and we have 505 to the good. So that's almost a little bit more push. We can get 50% return or better, knock that O down. All right, that said, let's go on now to CVS. CVS is right here. And there's CVS, same thing. We had the same similar problem. We had the, we anticipated the up the trend line to be here, and it stopped. So now we're going to wait for it to see if it regains going back in this direction, which would be kind of cool, because it'd be in our direction. We're going to move this trend line to the tip here to the end of the 30-day, anticipate that angle, and uh, the exit that we were figuring that's going to happen here is look like it's not going to happen. It's going to be looking like it might be happening way over here. So let's move over here and give it a little bit more running room and our also remove our morning track over a little bit. And there we are. And as I said before, mark your charts. Put all your information on your charts. It's your, it's your trade journal. And your trade journal for that specific trading instrument making it a lot easier to focus and to concentrate on a per instrument basis. That said, now we're going on to XLE. XLE is an interesting situation here. Uh, bring all this, all this stuff. What happened? Okay, just way over there. No problem. Bring it here. And so here we are. Bingo. There we go. All right. Same situation. We were anticipating the, the, the price action to go flat and intersect way over here, but apparently it's not going to happen. We're going to be waiting again for another candle to give us a better indication of the down, of the tr trend, uh, preferably going down because this is a put. And as a put, we're sitting in XLE at 52%. The Tigers were looking for a call. Remember, we were looking forward to a tug of war here, but it's not going to happen. And when we get to the Tigers, I'll explain what we're going to do when we get to the Tigers. At, um, this situation with the candles dropping with the price dropping today that takes us to walgreen now an interesting point here at walgreen uh and that is this we have one two three four we have four in the 50 percent club that is so cool that and remember if we get if we get our stop anywhere below remember the, here's the entry price and here's our 30 day moving average and then this was the anticipated circle based on the action that was going up now it's turned down in our put zone so we're looking maybe possibility of this going on down further down the line and uh with that said let's go ahead and draw our anticipated trend line off the 30-day moving average there it is so there is what we'll be looking at in the uh in the near future and the possibility may be here again toward the end of the week all right uh, that we still have two more leaders here in the alphas kr not much of not a lot not a lot of position but still something good it's now is, is reversing against us our warning track is in place uh we are still above the ep so if we can get if we can get the 30 day moving average ever so slightly below the entry price we could get look toward maybe kr getting out with a um break even remember there are five rules of the engagement one protect capital two protect profit three take profit four Exits do not retreat. And five is 
do your trading plan. Follow your trading plan. So uh, that said, let's go ahead now to the last one of the in the positive territory for the office. It's T A T and T. So letter T. Uh, same situation. Downtrend put. Uh, 30 day moving average here. Here's our 30 day moving average and here's our entry price. So we're not going to, we're not that close yet to get any drawing tools on this, but uh, it's looking good. It's looking good. Uh, the other two are lagging behind and that's pretty much it wraps it up for the alphas going over now to the tigers and starting with the tigers is CVX is their leader and their CVX is running at 27%. So, uh, there we are, we have that. And remember, this is price channel. So we are looking at the green price channel. This is a put. So we want that direction to go down. And you saw that we drew this, the, the original line here and it originally come way over here. Well, now it stopped and it's come back here. And now we're waiting for more price action below to try to establish some kind of a trend. Our out now is probably projecting somewhere over here now. Somewhere here toward the end of the week, maybe more, because as long as that price keeps dropping in that lower direction and the 30-day moving average keeps trading right behind it, uh, extending the gap between the entry point and the 30-day moving average, we are going to be looking at a nice – oh, I'm sorry. This is this is Tigers. <laughs> I didn't mix up. See, that's very important. So, but again, it's the same situation. The green price channel has not dropped yet. We have to for that green price channel to drop. And then we'll be looking at looking at maybe getting at 73%. So yeah, this is what uh, you what you just saw me go through is very critical if you are doing multiple strategies on the same platform. Even if it's two separate accounts, because of the fact is that they blend the the blend the charts. With the info so you it's a very good point about being alert and being on to what you're doing okay going on to pepsi let's wrap this up okay here we have uh pepsi pepsi is nice going nice down channel our price channel is up here in the green you can see it right there and uh we're looking for um we're looking to see if we can get another 70 percent 75 percent to get that last bar high because it is a put in the down direction coming over now to xlf XLF, same situation. Look at it. This, this are all, and these puts were put in here. You can look at, look at, look. These are the entry dates or the trigger date, one of the two. So the, you'll look at the date and say, okay, when did you put this trade in? Well, we did this trade almost two weeks ago. So it's another point. All right. Uh, everybody else is running in negative territory for the uh, Tigers. There was one adjustment for a uh, stop somewhere in one of these two, but nothing really to talk about. So that is a conclusion of today's report for the Losers Become Winners, September 21st. Alpha's lead with CBX. Remember this is a disclaimer that these trades are for my own. They are not yours. Your trades are your own, your own responsibility. Do your due diligence, do your trading plan, and stick to the rules. And with that said, I thank you very much for stopping by and checking it out. Bye-bye.